sort of the scout on ORU? They're really good. Um, they got three really dynamic offensive weapons uh, in Weaver, uh, Thompson, and McBride. Uh, McBride and Thompson, who hardly ever come off the court. Uh, so they just keep coming at you. And, and um, I think they I think they're one and two in the country in, in minutes per game, I think. Um, and so what that does is they, they have a great sense of how to evaluate the game as it goes, right? They're not coming out and having to sit or starting on the bench and coming in. Uh, and so that, that gives a different element of – of how you prepare for guys like that. And one of the things is you don't want to let them get off to a good start because they can they can play well the whole game. Uh, the other thing is you got to try to give them different looks and try to wear them down over the course of the game, and hopefully they fatigue out, uh, which obviously they're conditioned well enough 10 games in to be able to play through most of the game. Uh, but they're really, really good offensively. Uh, they don't have a ton of size, but they're competitive in there. they got a freshman big who's getting better. Uh, I've just been really, really impressed with, with Russ and what he's doing over there. Obviously, taking over a program that's been really successful is hard because the expectations don't change, especially when you have guys who return um, that have been a part of that success. Uh, so kudos to him. They, you know, they had case they beat uh, two weeks ago. Uh, they lost to Tech last night. They played a really tough schedule, and um, we got a tall task ahead of us.